Alex, uh, good to hear from you. I've uh, thank you first of all for the awakening you've given me, or you've been part of my awakening in the last year. But I've kind of woken up to a lot of the stuff. Well, we're all in this together, and, brother. So thank you. Uh, the item I wanted to address with you was the financial markets, and I think what you were saying yesterday, and I listened to the podcast, is absolutely right. I believe the uh, now you, the term you use is New World Order. I have my own pet term for it, which I call Parasite Guild or the Cabal. No, I agree. It's, it's, and, it's the Parasite College of Control Freak World for those that couldn't actually do for themselves who wish to conquer the planet in all of their great grandeur. Go ahead. Well, they're out in force. I think they came out in force with uh, last May or June. First it was Lloyd Blankenfein with uh, Goldman Sachs. He goes on the, uh, the pet network, which is CNBC, and really psychopathic snake type stuff and then he's followed up by uh, greenspan uh he followed they followed up with the B uh, bank of international settlements which essentially the rothschild banks have been threat really issuing thinly veiled threats and it and then and then last week you had the g20 so it's not like they're not warning people that they're going to pull the plug and I think it's uh, part of it is psychopathic gloating that they like to engage in. And then there's a good term that you've given me, uh, predictive programming. I think that's part of it. Revelation of the and method, externalization of the hierarchy. And then they can also tell you later, see, I told you it was coming. Exactly. But, but covering and being part of the problem reaction solution. So I, I, I really saw, saw, see this uh, watching financial news. I used to be on Wall Street, spent a half life on Wall Street. And I, I have to tell you that the, the whole money management business has been badly compromised. It seems like they're bri everybody's bribed and controlled. And I used to be in that business. And when I was in that business, we had such a, a thing called fiduciary responsibility. And I, I didn't take orders from anybody when I was a, when I was a money manager. And now I, the scuttlebutt I hear is this total control. They've stolen Aunt Millie's money, and I, I worry for Aunt Millie, uh, the people that have their money placed with Wall Street and with these money ma managers. And I don't think the uh, outcome is going to be good. It feels also that this is concurrent with a lot of these false flags that you've been talking about. So the whole predictive programming, the gloating, the butt covering, and this show they put on, it seems like it's almost kind of uh, concurrent with false, false flag warnings as well. It's definitely the season of crises. They've already turned Al-Qaeda loose. They're already attacking Russia. They're already just... Poking the Chinese, who are the Chinese are, government's terrible, but I mean, still they're poking them. Uh, it's just a lot of uh, bravado, chutzpah driven, just wild man behavior going on by the establishment. And so I just hope that uh, cooler heads can prevail somehow and that some good things can happen and we can kind of get this corruption under control. But I don't know, my friend. Great points. Thank you so much, Russ, from the Czech Republic. Jesse in Oregon, you're on the air. Welcome. Hey, Alex. Great to be on with you today. Thanks for calling. Hey, uh, hey I was wanting to bring up something that's really important for us here in Oregon coming up this election. And myself being a, a chef-only organic restaurant in the Dallas, Oregon, um, we're coming up on uh, Measure 92, voting to label GMO here in Oregon. And I hadn't heard you talk about that yet, so I just wanted to put out to your audience. Well, I know that they clearly rigged the election in California. I mean, why can't you have GMO labeled? Uh, I don't know. I mean, you'd think if they were proud of it, they'd want the label. Yeah, I mean, this so, corn, bugs don't eat it because it's got biologically grown, pharmacological crop pesticide. And, you know, there's nothing like liver failure. Why not advertise it? Yeah, yeah, you know, you should, if you're making a great product, be proud of it. That's what I do. You know, I make a great product. Every well, that day. sounds That's a little organic. bit terrorist, you know, to actually want to know what's in your food. Yeah. How dare you? <laughs> so, you know, um, have all, you know, everybody kind of, you know, we got tons of money from out of state, big corporations and mega corporations pumping in money into the state to say no on 92. And we're, we want yes on 92. We want our stuff labeled. And so, well, how dare you, know, you want to know if something's GMO? I, I think that's terrible. And I think it's good that they, you know, are firing people off TV, like Rob uh, Schneider, who speaks out and says America's becoming fascist. Of course we're fascist. And you're fired. And you're fired too, caller. Get out of here, Jesse. How dare you? How dare you? You worship. Oh, I, I mentioned Kim Jong-un. I'm going to go to break and come back with more of your calls.
this story illustrates a lot. That Kim Jong-un is 31. He grew up in Switzerland and is so disconnected, he thinks getting a mega nerd basketball washed up player who's been hated for a decade to come there is really cool. But people think money and power is about everything. Actually, all the evil comes back on you. He hasn't been seen for months, and now they admit in state-run media that he has discomfort and is ill. So see, all of you that sell out for petty power and narcissism, this is what you end up producing. A 31-year-old literal tick who I bet's dead in five years. Totally unhealthy, totally unhappy. You can look in that guy's eyes and all of them. The leadership looks more freaked out than the starving peasants. Living under that, oh, but look at the red carpet. And it's fancy. The government's invincible. It's big and powerful. No, it's not. There's government worship there for you. All the Democrats and Republicans, you should worship Kim Jong-un. He's an example of what you believe in. Briefly, uh, we did get a limited amount of DNA force in. We're going to get more in in the next week or two. If you want to get it and support the broadcast and your own body's health, this has the astrologous root, the bio-enhanced transreservatol, the NAR, lipotic acid, P40P, trademark, patented, palm granite extract, a bunch, a bunch of other just incredible stuff is in here. The Q, the Q10, the CoQ10, the Zag enzyme, digestive synthetic enzyme, Bio PQQ. That's the really expensive stuff, and just a bunch of other things that are known to absolutely detoxify, supercharge, regenerate. Uh, helps the uh, mitochondria, the DNA, and we're you notice we don't say this with other products because because you can't. With this stuff being patented and, and certified, it's a nutraceutical, we can. Infowarslife.com. Similar formulas that aren't even as strong are 300 to $600. This is a Rolls Royce of supplements and it helps fund our operation. Infowarslife.com or 888-253-3139. In fact, here's some of the things about DNA Force. Our cells are under daily attack by GMOs, radiation, toxins, microwaves, DNA is your blueprint. This is the most amazing product yet from For Wars Health uh, line, exclusive formula based on Nobel Prize winning scientific discovery designed by top scientists with mathematically synergistic combinations, uh, incredible effort to produce, highest quality, difficult to procure, to cultivate, very complicated to manufacture. Manufactured at the highest standards, supports healthy cellular function, contains specific minerals, cofactors, and enzymes essential for powering cells. Give your body the force field it needs. Power your potential. Optimize your powerhouse, your cells to fight back against the toxic environment. InfoWarsLife.com or 888-253-3139. And be sure and support our local AM and FM affiliates as well. Get a bottle of X2, Survival Shield, nascent iodine. To see what that does for you. The fluoride shield, the super male vitality, the super female vitality. Just try it. And I know you'll become a repeat customer and help fund our operation and get a great quality product that helps you and your family. Because this stuff is all the highest quality. No games here. Infowarslife.com. Mary in Texas, go ahead. You're on the air. I love InfoWars, all you guys up there, Rob, Richard, the party. I appreciate all the work y'all do. Well, thank things. you. Talk right in your telephone running, for me. I'm running for mayor in Austin as a 9-11 truther. I'm pro-gun, pro-weed, and pro-trees. And we also want to talk about a mess problem. We've been having mess flow the streets, especially at the spillway, and that's why the cop patrol was up over the last month or two. Yeah, there's drugs just pouring in everywhere. The government usually isn't too involved in meth. It's mainly cocaine, heroin, stuff they can geographically control. But uh, what's your name, and uh, uh, Mary, so people can check into your campaign? Mary Krennic, I'm first on the list. I did a lot of work with Vote Rescue here in town, and one of my main issues is the electronic election fraud. Oh, yeah, I recognize your voice. I think I've met you before, Mary. Definitely. I just love you guys' show. Well, Thank send us some info. Me. Send us some info. I'm going to do a little bit of overdrive to finish up with calls. Will, Floyd, Joe, and Shaggy. Infowars.com forward slash show to find the free feeds. Back this Sunday, 4 Visit to 6 p.m. Central. Today. Don't take the show for granted, folks. They want to shut it off.
from the water table to our soils to the atmosphere itself, our world is becoming more and more toxic each and every day. But it's not just the air outside that's toxic. Indoor air has been shown to have two to five times higher concentrations of pollutants than even outdoor air. And most Americans spend 90% of their time inside using toxic chemicals within their homes. There are more than 42 million smokers in the United States. Well over a thousand types of mold and mildew linked to numerous conditions. And don't forget the fact that six million Americans live with pets they're allergic to as well. When I began to research these statistics, it was clear to me it was time to start cleansing my lungs in order to combat the toxic environment that we cannot escape but that we can fight back against. Made with organic and wild cultivated herbs and manufactured in the USA, the new InfoWars Life Lung Cleanse is here in a convenient spray bottle that can be brought with you throughout any toxic environment. Now available exclusively at InfoWarsLife.com or by calling toll-free 888-253-3139. 